Hey guys, I'm Sharon Vaknin, and if you're trying to get in shape, you know that your phone is your best workout buddy. With all the apps for tracking your fitness, getting free workouts, and free tools like timers, you're going to want this by your side at all times. I've seen people do everything from shove their phone in their sports bra to putting it in their waistband or just holding it in their sweaty hands while they work out. That's gross. Instead, I have a few better solutions for storing your phone while you work out, including a couple of do-it-yourself solutions. The most obvious and expensive solution is a dedicated armband for your phone. They usually cost about 20 to 30 bucks and involve an elastic and some sort of case. But that can be a problem because every time you use that armband, you need to remove your phone from its original case and put it in this one instead. Over time, that'll damage your case, plus it's just annoying to do. So instead of buying one of these, you can make your own armband out of a sock. To make this armband, just grab an old tube sock you have at home. The tube part needs to be at least 8 inches so it can accommodate your phone. Then grab a pair of scissors and cut off that tube part. Now turn the tube inside out so that the decorative part is facing outwards when you wear it. Now slip it on your arm, fold it in half, and place your phone in the pocket. As you can see, it's pretty secure. You can't access the screen, but you can plug in your headphones, listen to your favorite music, or follow along to a workout app. Now, there is one more solution. It's created by a company called Underfuse, which started on Kickstarter. It's actually an iron-on pocket that you can add to your existing workout gear. Eight bucks gets you one pocket, and 20 bucks gets you three of these guys. It works best on tight-fitting clothing, like these shorts. Place the pocket where you want it to go. I recommend putting it on the front thigh area of your pants or shorts. Then set your iron to the cotton setting, which should be medium or high. And you want to iron just the edges of the pocket, not that stretchy material. It'll take you about a minute for the pocket to completely adhere. Make sure you get all the edges and the corners because you don't want your phone falling out while you're working out. When you're done, wait about 10 minutes to let the pocket cool, and then you'll be ready to use your new shorts or pants. Now, with my underfuse on my shorts, I can put my phone in the pocket and work out without having my phone get in the way. So, as you can see, I can move around freely while the pocket keeps my phone nice and secure while I work out. This is my favorite solution, but try any of these tips and figure out which one works best for you. If you have any questions, hit me up on Twitter or say hello on my Facebook page. For CNET.com, I'm Sharon Vaknin.